Hi guys, welcome to this video about what you can do when you get a black box with Chrome Exe every time you uh, turn up or turn down the volume. So I'm pressing now turn up volume and we get this really strange black box uh, with the volume. I mean, you see, I put it up, I turn it down, uh, but I mean, I'm, I'm not worried. Uh, I mean, this thing doesn't bother me too much, this molding, but the big one, the big box, which has just uh, three buttons and two of them are disabled. Just the play is here and I don't see why it would be here. Uh, there's nothing to play here. It says Chrome Exe and it wastes a lot of space. It really bothers me sometimes. I cannot see what's behind. So I'm trying to get rid of that. Usually when I just leave it, uh, when I don't push uh, volume up and down, it goes away after a certain time. Uh, now it looks like it stays forever. I don't know. It's a little bit different. So what? Uh, yeah, okay. It <laughs> went away, but took long, long time. So uh, I have seen there is something which you can uh, like a address where you can go to Chrome Flex hardware media key handling. So let's go there and see what we can do. Yeah, I have to admit I've never been on this page before. That's really interesting. Chrome has a lot of menus. So it looks like we have to go here and we select disabled. Okay. And yeah, there's on the right side here you can see that it uh, there's a relaunch now uh, key. So I'm doing that now. Okay. It so yeah, I, I paused the video a little bit, took me a couple of seconds to reboot. I mean, I did nothing. I just pressed on this button to reboot and now I'm here again. So now I'm pushing again my hardware buttons on my keyboard to increase or decrease the volume. And so let's see what happens. Yeah, that's exactly what I wanted. This small black box, I, I'm not bothered by this small black box, which anyway goes away really fast. But it was this huge black thing which do does nothing, which really bothered me. So it looks like this is the thing what you need. I'll put down the direct link to this page into the description so you can uh, copy and paste it. Or maybe you can even click on that right away and disable this hardware media key handling and then go down to the right side where this reboot thing will, uh, will appear, press it, let it reboot and that's it. So I hope I was able to help you a little bit with that. If you have any questions or comments, just write to the comment section below. I'm always happy to talk about these things. And if you like the video, give me a thumbs up, subscribe my channel. Thanks for watching and see you next time.